In this tutorial, we're going to take a look at using the guided access, and this allows you to lock the iPad into one app for, so that your students will not be distracted and try exiting the app. Uh, let's say if you have them working out in centers and working on a particular app and you don't want them going other places, you can put it into guided access. So the first thing you're going to do is go into your settings, and under general, you're going to scroll down to your accessibility. Under accessibility, you're going to look for right here in the center where it says guided access. You're going to want to make sure that guided access is turned on and you're going to set a passcode. So uh, when you set your passcode, this is what's going to lock that iPad. So I'm just going to type in my passcode and then I'm going to go back out here uh, to the home screen and I'm going to open up a particular app that I want the kids to be in. Let's say I'm going to have them do jumbled sentences and I'm going to triple click my home key or my home button and it's going to give me the option to turn guided access on. I'm going to turn my guided access on and uh, it's going to give me these options down here at the bottom and I'm just going to hit start. Now I can be in this app and I cannot exit the app. So uh, you'll notice that I'll try to um, swipe back and forth, and I can't do it. But I can enter in, and I can um, play my game or do my app. Uh, but I cannot get out, and I can't five-finger scrunch it. If I triple-click home, it's going to ask me for the passcode that I set to turn my guided access on. And now this is going to allow me to turn it off. And that's how you use the guided access. So now that I'm out of it, I can scrunch it down, or if I'm in it, I can swipe between apps uh, to get back and forth. So that's how you turn guided access off.